Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do my September weekly spending tracker. Um, this is the first week. It's from August 24th to 30th. Um, I got paid August 23rd, but the entire paycheck went into the September budget. So that is why my numbers are a little bit weird. And that is why um, a week in August is in my September budget. Um, I'm also apologizing for, you know, the, the lighting and stuff I am filming at night and that's what it will be for, um, actually quite a while. So, um, I hope you guys don't mind the, the lighting there. I changed the, the lighting around so it's not a big shadow anymore. Anyways, so that is that. So our categories for this month is eating out. Um, that has $30. I cut that way down from $100 to $30 because I really want us to stick to um, not eating out as much. We don't um, go out to restaurants, but we do sometimes get Tim Hortons drinks and stuff, so um, that money adds up. So I really want us to spend less than $30 this month. Um, groceries, $500. That's a usual. Gas, $160. Since I'm working now, I have to spend a lot of money on gas. And my husband works 15 minutes out of town, so he has to drive a lot. Um, our son, he um, eats quite a bit, and I want to keep track of how much we're spending on him, such as clothes, diapers, milk, food, snacks, all that jazz. So that is that. Um, other, this is like the catch-all category, like the miscellaneous or unbudgeted category. This is just um, something that we have to have. Um, because if something happens, we want to take out of an envelope, so it has to be other. Um, and then my husband likes to keep some cash on him get just in case something happens or he's um, stuck somewhere and, you know, needs money. So um, I always let him have that little bit since he's, he's sending me his entire paycheck to pay bills and to um, be in charge of our money. So I like to you know, give him a little bit of cash. And we're only, like, he usually doesn't spend it, but this time um, he wanted to spend a little bit of money on me and him for a nice dinner, so um, he spent his money this week. I also do want to show you guys my cash envelopes that I have been using. They're nothing fancy. They're just printed off with regular paper, and um, I put my own stickers on it. These are Once More With Love stickers. And, um, yeah, I just made them for every category that I have. So gas, baby, that little, um, llama sticker is so cute. Groceries, events. So, um, I have a couple birthdays to pay for, so that's what the 60 bucks is for. And then other. So, I love the cash envelopes. Um, I know that they're, they're, they're nothing special, but, um, it, what's, it's working for us, so I'm just going to keep up with that. Um, also, I'm sorry for not filming as much this week. Um, it's been a crazy week and a half. I ended up switching jobs. Um, I might do another video with that, so I went from full-time to part-time, um, it wasn't my choice, but it just wasn't working out where I was. Um, yeah, it's just a huge, <laughs> huge discussion that I won't have in this video because I know a lot of you guys are new. Um, but for those of you that have followed me for a while, um, I might explain it into like a further video. Um, I also have a new Instagram up. It's Budget Queen 2018. So if you want to follow that, um, I, I put more personal posts up and I post every day and it's super interactive and you guys get to see step by step and even some of my like daily stuff that I have in my budget binder that I do, um, I share more of that just rather than just doing um, my bullet journal stuff. So it's really, it would be really awesome if you guys followed me on that um yeah it should be fun anyways enough with the the chit chat um let's get right into the video all right so we did go out of town um 
the last couple weekends um, to visit my family. Uh, so we did spend money on eating out. So we spent twenty eight thirty one. Sorry, my writing is really bad today. So it leaves us with one dollar and sixty nine cents. <laughs> so I know that's already the the budget, but we don't eat out much, and that was two weekends of traveling. So um, I don't find that bad at all. Groceries. I'm gonna use my. I hope this lighting doesn't bug you guys um, with my hand here, but I need to hold down the page. Groceries was one eighty six seventy one. We still have three thirteen twenty nine. Um, I'm trying to do two hundred and fifty dollars um, every two weeks, so we are on budget as far as I know. Gas was eighty nine fourteen. We did do a lot of traveling, so um, lots of gas is needed. So $70.86 is left over. My son, we spent $20. It was a lot of snacks and milk. So he still has $130. Other was $6. My husband got his, um, our Jeep washed. So that was nice because it's, um, with all the fires going on where I live, um, I live in Canada, just so you know, and um, our province was in a state of emergency, so um, yeah, the fires were creating a lot of smoke, and with that comes ash, and there was ash all over our Jeep, so we just cleaned it off and got it ready for, for the bunch of traveling that we did, so um, yeah. Um, $40 was spent for my husband. He, um, with the job switch and it not being my choice, I was very, um, upset and overwhelmed. As you can see, I bite my nails like crazy, so don't judge me. That's my way of coping with things. I don't smoke. I don't drink. Um, so I just bite my nails out of anxiety and, he saw that, so he, um, I didn't know what to make for dinner, and he decided to buy a lot of, like, already pre-made Chinese food. <laughs> it sounds so gross, but, like, all, like, it's in the frozen section of the grocery store. It was actually more expensive than just going out to, like, a Chinese buffet, but <laughs> it was awesome because we watched movies and hung out, and, um, he knows I also really miss that from, from me working so much um, to actually just hanging out. Um, it was really, really nice. And I respect him for realizing that I needed that time with him. And then for him using his allowance for that, it just, it was extra special because he knows I'm, I'm trying to be strict with our budget and he knows that too. Anyways, so the spent total was 300 Seventy dollars and sixteen cents. Yeah, which is quite a bit, but we did need a ton of groceries. Bills, here's the big one. Seventeen fifty seven thirty three. We had to pay rent, Jeep, um, all the debts, all that stuff. So the total for that is two thousand one hundred twenty seven dollars and forty nine cents for that entire week um if you're new to my channel week one and week three are the weeks that we get paid and those are always um big expenses and big bills such as two thousand dollars um week two and week four are mainly you know a couple hundred bucks from what we spend in our categories but since we're being so cheap lately um I think like week two and week four will be like honestly barely anything, but um, we do have a lot of bills. We do have a lot of stuff to pay, so it is steep and you guys might not have that, but please don't judge because there's nothing I can do <laughs> to control this. Um, yeah, 
I hope you guys like this video. If you do, please subscribe. Also, follow me on Instagram. Um, I'd love to talk to you guys and um, connect further there. And yeah, so hopefully you guys like this video. Thanks for watching. Bye.